Hello, you have your very unprofessional videographer here. Um, I just purchased a new gun today, and uh, I noticed a lot of guys on YouTube do an unboxing video. Usually I don't. I just pull them out and start shooting and worry about it later. But, uh, but I picked up one of these Bushmaster. It's one of the Carbon 15s. It's an AR-15, but it's got a carbon upper and lower receiver mount, or housings, I should say. Um, Got this at Mills Fleet Farm, state I live in and uh, and shop at. The, the state I live in and shop at has these stores. Um, a lot of people ask, what is Mills Fleet Farm? Well, it's like a Cabela's, Gander Mountain, and Lowe's, and um, Home Depot all rolled into one. So, carried this gun out the door today for $781. That was including tax and all that. Um, when you get it, open the box up. Here is the rifle itself. Okay, it's a carbon AR-15. Um, you can tell here, carbon fiber is four times stronger than aluminum. So, any of your lower receiver aluminums, um, I mean, this gun is very light. Any of the aluminum ones are going to be way heavier, believe it or not. Um, but yeah, I think this gun unloaded is less than six pounds. And it comes with your standard flat top, sort of an A2 style. It's got a 16 inch carbine uh, upper receiver. Okay, sort of your birdcage flash suppressor there. Chrome line barrel, 109 twist. Um, very nice gun. I, I have yet to fire it, as you can see. This is fresh out of the box from where I bought it. When you get the gun, it'll come with your standard chamber flag. Just always throw those aside. And uh, it has your forward assist and it has a trap door here so that's always nice I mean a lot of people don't realize that the trap door helps keep dirt and everything else out uh, very nice features to have some guns have some don't some don't have the forward assist and some do I guess if you're going to be in a non-combat situation you don't really need these two items but if a gun comes with it that's cool I mean I definitely take it every time and then it comes with a standard four position collapsible stock. I don't really like the stock to be honest with you. It's sort of hard to manipulate. It'd be one of the first things I replace. But uh, So there you go. You get the gun and um, it comes optics ready. Obviously with the flat top. You get an optic that comes with in this little box. And at the store while the lady was filling out the paperwork I threw a battery in this optic. Um, I believe it's a Tasco. I believe. And it's got a couple little flip-up lens covers in there, so uh, you can sort of see there if you if I can zoom in on this or get her focused. That's the sort of reticle that you'll have. That's the single um, stage reticle. You cannot adjust. You can see I'm going from dim to bright to the brightest. So, uh, but it's nice that it comes with a little optic, and uh, the brightest settings are pretty freaking bright. It's like a laser beam in your eyes. So, comes with that. Also comes with the rings and mount. So you just put her on the flat top rail on your standard Picatinny rail, and you just screw it on. Sight her in. These guns guns are bore sighted. Also comes with one standard 30 round GI mag. It's one of these stamped mags, and uh, it's Mark Bushmaster. So that's that's cool. And you obviously get your instruction kit and everything else in the box. They used to include two magazines with this, but now with all this gun scare, you know, you can figure why they don't. Um, this video is being made as of April 17, 2013. So you can see you get your owner's manual here. It's nice. Got some tips in here for people that have never handled one of these. You know, my dad was handling this. And he's I mean, he's into using the old Winchesters and Remington, so. That manual will be very helpful. Obviously, the NRA join today, save ten bucks. Join the NRA. Everybody should be a member. Um, and and then you get obviously a little gun lock here. I don't even think this is stamp Bushmaster. Nope, just some phony gun lock. I mean, I've got a whole box of these. I don't even never use them because I don't have kids doing anything running around. But then you get a nice little looks like just a standard two point excuse me one and a half inch sling so nylon but yeah that's what you get with the gun 
and like I said, I picked up this gun today at Mills Fleet Farm. It was um, 781 bucks out the door after taxes. And I wasn't really expecting to buy one today, but I just did because uh, I, I've never owned a carbon rifle. And the way the market is, I thought, well, what the hell? Price is right, why not buy it? And, you know, and, and it, it has very subtle differences between um, any AR that I own. Um, the barrel's pretty thin, I will give you that. I'm not sure of the make of the barrel, but it's B um, space MP. So I, I believe I've heard of that name, but I know all my other guns have ER Shaw barrels. And But this is chrome line. It's not chrome molly. It's completely chrome line, bore and chamber. So um, it should be a good gun. You know, I'm not, I'm not downfalling it at all. It's just I've yet to own one of these carbons. But they're four times stronger than aluminum. So apparently this is way stronger, you know, just like a Glock pistol would be. So, but thanks for watching, and uh, I hope to get this out to the range. Fortunately, all of our ammo, as of April 2013, we're having this crisis with ammo. But uh, it'd be nice to get it out and do some blasting, see what kind of holes we can punch with it. But thanks for watching, and uh, and I really appreciate it. So, thanks again.